عندما يلتقي الطموح الرغبة الإصرار معا يحجز النجاح مقعده دائما في المقدمة هنا من لبنان هنا من بيروت هنا من ساحة النجمة مقر البرلمان اللبناني ذا مانجر يبدأ معكم من هنا رادولوفيتش المدير الفني للمنتخب اللبناني وقصة نجاح من هنا تبدأ الحكاية مبروك نجاح جميل تأهل بالمنتخب اللبناني لتاني مرة في تاريخه لكأس أمم آسيا هنا من هذا المكان كانت الجلسة الأولى مع السيد هاشم حيدر رئيس الاتحاد اللبناني هنا كان وضع حجر الأساس لنجاح تم ولادته ببراعة لكرة القدم اللبنانية إيه التفاصيل وإزاي حصل النجاح وإيه الاتفاق اللي تم مع السيد هاشم حيدر Yes, uh, my first meeting with Mr. President Hashim Haidar was in this coffee three and a half years ago. We talk about uh, Lebanon football, about future, about uh, my job. And uh, <clears throat> that time I saw that we have same vision about uh, Lebanese uh, national team future. I, I promised them that my task and my desire is to come uh, and take the Lebanon national team and uh, reach some uh, big competition like Asia Cup. Thanks God, after three and a half years, we are in Asia Cup, first time in history. I'm uh, very proud. This is dream of all generation Lebanon football players and Lebanon fans. حولت جمهور كرة القدم اللبناني العاشق والمحب دائما لكرة السلة إلى حب كرة القدم من جديد تلاحم الجمهور اللبناني كله مع اتحاد كرة القدم مع المنتخب إلى كرة القدم إحساسك كنت ماشي في الشارع قبل ثلاث سنين ونص وإحساسك كنت ماشي في الشارع الآن مع الجماهير اللبنانية When I came in Lebanon I saw that Football is in the shadow of basketball. Basketball is uh, sport number one. But I also saw the potential of players. Uh, there is a lot of poor uh, natural talents. And uh, I saw that uh, we can make one good group of players. And uh, with uh, continually work, with a lot of training session, with the camps, uh, friendly games, we can do success like uh, Asian Cup. Thanks God, uh, we make a very good job. Uh, I'm proud of uh, my players. First of all, thanks to them. We reach Asia Cup, thanks to my staff. Uh, they are very professional and uh, organized work. And also thanks to members of Federation. They support us a lot. We feel this support and all together we make this result. Part, all of them, in our success is uh, big. Mr. Drag, when I started here with the Lebanese government, what are the experiences that you have? What are the experiences that you started with? You have to take a government to the 155 on the world. بتتفاوض من اجل النجاح ايه عناصر النجاح اللي انت لقيتها في البدايه او اللي انت بنيت عليها طموحك اللي بيها توصل لهذه المرحله وانت موجود في كاس امم اسيا كيف كانت الخطوات الاولى في مشوارك مع المنتخب اللبناني first for me was a big challenge to come in Lebanon to be first one who will make success like qualifying to Asia Cup because I saw possibilities of players. I believe in this 
equality this possibility and in my work uh, in football nothing has happened over the night it's a long process but thanks god we work uh, hard of uh, camps and uh, we do a lot of friendly games during these camps training session and games uh, young players gradually progressing and uh, this is a result after three and a half years first time as a cup qualifying 16 games without, without defeat lose. without lose yes. and uh, ranking from uh, 155 to 77 position eight in asia i'm really proud of this result i'm really proud of my players and uh, i hope all the Liban lebanon fans is proud of uh, their national team now لما بدات مع المنتخب اللبناني كثير من اللاعبين امكانياتهم كويسه نجوم بقيمه رضا عنتر وعطوي ويوسف و... في حساباتك كان هي المجموعه دي اللي هتحقق لك هدفك ولا كان في مخططك ان مع الوقت هيبتدي عمليه الاحلال والتجديد وتبتدي تكون لمنتخب لبنان اعمار اقل والاستغناء خطوه خطوه عن النجوم فكرت في المنطقه دي او النقطه دي ازاي Uh, when I came 2015 in Lebanon, I came uh, just one month before start World Cup qualifying. I have short time to change any things. Yes. Uh, I have uh, good team, icons of football, but in age of 37, 36, 35, uh, like uh, Rodantar, Yusuf Dodo, Mohammed, Abbas, Atvi, and uh, we play good this uh, qualifying. We finish on second place, but uh, uh, not enough points to go to uh, last round World Cup. After that, I had uh, one year to preparing team. During this year, I changed generation. I, uh, and the key point of this success is I put uh, some young players in team. And uh, during the camps, what I told before, and the friendly games, uh, they rise their abilities game per game they play better they progressing and uh, thanks god now we are on the disposition on asia cup first time in history مرحب من جديد خدنا جولة شفنا البداية للتعاقد مع مدرب نجح في المهمة الموكلة لي ميودراج رادولوفيتش كان عنده حسن الظن التعاقد تم من أجل تحقيق هدف تم تحقيق الهدف ووصلت لبنان إلى كأس أمم آسيا ما بين المجموعات الستة اللي هيشاركوا في كأس أمم آسيا منتخب لبنان بيقع في مجموعة فيها السعودية فيها قطر فيها كوريا الشمالية تصورك للمجموعة مين الأقرب للتأهل وحظوظ منتخب لبنان فيها شايفه عامل إزاي؟ We are very proud and for us it's big honor to be in this company really in Asia Cup there is not a weak team I know very well which opponent wait us and I will preparing my team for them When we talk about Qatar first game, because first focus is on the Qatar, is a team who is progressing very well, especially in the last two years. Their infrastructure and their league is very strong. Uh, also, they send players to Europe yes. to change mentality, to training on Europe style and play there. And they build a really, really very strong team. For my opinion, one of the favorites to take Asia Cup with uh, Iran, with South Korea, and uh, with uh, maybe Australia, Arabia also. It's, for me, it's favorite for this. For us, it's, it's good to play with Arab countries it's a similar style like us 
I hope we have uh, a lot of time to prepare in my team, especially we will make one uh, camp during the December in Antalya. Uh, also, I try to register some new players. Lebanese origin from two from Europe, one from the Sweden League and one from Mexico. And I hope we will be a quiet opponent for everyone. التطور الكبير اللي حصل للكرة اللبنانية دورك ككوتش بتعتبره نسبته قد إيه لهذا التطور سواء من حيث النتائج من حيث العروض من حيث الهبوط بمعدل السن للاعبين دورك في هذه المرحلة كان بيمثل نسبة كام تقريبا وهل هذا المنتخب قادر على تكملة ما بعد هذه المرحلة أم هذه المرحلة ويبتدي بناء مرحلة جديدة رأيك إيه؟ For all coach it's very important things to make good touch with player. My first task was to make good atmosphere. We really, atmosphere play a big role in our success because we are like big family and everyone know his place in uh, our group. Also, I talk a lot individually with my players I try to push them to believe in, his, in their quality and to get confidence. And easy day per day, I change their mentality and uh, my team now have a winner mentality, what, what I want. All those games, we, we play uh, really good because uh, when uh, was a draw in Abu Dhabi, everyone thinks that uh, North Korea is favorite number one, and for second place, they'll be fighting between uh, Malaysia and Hong Kong. We st I'm starting to prepare my team game per game, and we start uh, very good with Hong Kong and win 2-0. And after that, continually, we play very good qualifying. It's proud for me that I saw that my players continually and gradually progressing camps to camps and game per game. We make five win, one draw, no lose, uh, score 16 games, and we have the best result in all the group. This is what I am proud. One more time, thanks to my player, because the biggest role of my players, thanks to my staff, and also people from Federation are support us a lot. All together, we put now Lebanon on football map, and now it's really be good to, uh, to be good uh, members of national teams when uh, Congratulations coming for all the world. Coach, بيعني إيه للمدرب لما يلعب منتخب سواء كان منتخب قوي أو ضعيف مصنف أو غير مصنف ويكون مدرب هذا المنتخب مدرب كبير عندنا في البطولة مجموعة مدربين منهم بطل العالم مارتشيلو ليبي مع منتخب الصين عندنا زاكيروني مثلا مدرب الإيطالي الكبير مع منتخب الإمارات عندنا كيروش مع منتخب ايران واحد المنتخبات الكبيره والعملاقه في البطوله ايضا بينتو مع منتخب كوريا انت ككوتش لما بتقابل فريق معاه كوتش كبير اسمه كبير بتعني ايه بالنسبه لك كل اللاعبين وهل بتوصل الرساله للاعبين من خلال التعامل معاه حساباتك بتكون ايه لما تلعب فريق الكوتش بتاعه كبير فور مي ريلي ويل بي بليجر اند اونر to be in this company and to make competition to them and also to compare myself to them. Sure, we don't lead the same team. Their team is too strong and their team is maybe a team who can win Asia Cup. But sure, for me, it's a big challenge to make competition to them. And also, I know from, 
from uh, my way how we will play against those teams if we play against them. Sure, now uh, if we need to meet them, I need to pass first round. I will do my the best and my players to meet those coach on the competitions there. Coach, كتير من ماتشاتك وانت مع منتخب لبنان وحققت هذا الانجاز من ضمن اخر 16 مباراه كان بيقولوا لنا خساره الى ان جاءت خساره منتخب الكويت الوديه بتلعب بسيستم 4 1 4 1 واحيانا بتغير بسيستم اخر 3 4 3 انت ككوتش هل انت مقتنع ككوتش بان كره القدم تحتاج 3 4 3 افضل او 4 1 4 1 افضل ولا منتخب لبنان هو اللي محتاج دي لظروف امكانياته بناء على ايه بتختار السيستم وبناء على ايه ممكن تغيره to build a good team and good team performance uh, need the time uh, thanks god players accept my style of work and they trust me and this is also a quality of the team that they can change uh, system from my side it's all about uh, the pens of opponents for example during the qualifying when we play home and we need win sure that we play with more attackers and more midfielders and from another side when we play a strong team like Korea and Pyongyang and here we need to be more uh, secure but also every time because I was a former midfielder, my style is over attacking football. And for that, for this reason, 3-4-3, three, three, now I prefer, and we will try to play an Asia Cup on this system. I believe that uh, this system, 3-4-3, three, three, will be useful for us, and uh, we already make some good result with these systems, but also I will prepare my team to another choice, uh, for example, if we need during the game to win or to, to uh, keep result, we can change 4-1, 4-1 or 4-4-2. And also, I will repeat, this is the quality of the team, uh, of the players. Now we are together three and a half years and we, we understand each other very good. Coach, the first time you played in CAS Asia in your team, your team five, تبقى يوم 9 يناير بطولة هتنطلق يوم 5 يوم 9 عندك المباراة الأولى مع منتخب قطر شايف منتخب قطر في المرحلة دي في الوقت ده أصبح إزاي ما بين ثلاث سنوات ونص ليك مع منتخب لبنان قبلها مع الجعرة مع كازما أنت متابع جيد والآن ستلعب أمام قطر شايف قطر كفريق إمكانياته إيه أصبح إيه ممكن المباراة يكون شكلها إيه because our first game is against Qatar, now all my focus is on the Qatar yes. national team. Yes. Uh, I can say that uh, generally Qatar football progressing uh, too much in the last two, three years because of infrastructure, because of building of team and uh, because they are next hosting of uh, World Cup. Uh, I saw now very good vision of uh, national team. They uh, put all young players, uh, they send young players to Europe to play on Europe style, to change mentality, to get professional uh, things. And all of this is reflecting on national team on the good uh, side. For example, Ali Afif and Al Muez Almoez Ali, Ali <coughs> perfect young players. Also, Captain Al Haidouz. Al Al Haidouz. Mm. I know the uh, trees, but all team play very compact, very speed, very fast. Uh, I know that two teams is in the semi final of Asia Champions League. All these things uh, talking that uh, Qatar football progressing. A lot it will be difficult much it will be very difficult but i believe really i believe in my team i'm an optimist coach 
uh, I have uh, experience for uh, European Championship and Olympic game. For example, one time with uh, my uh, Montenegro national team, I passed a very difficult group with three draw. Why not repeat that time now? Yes. I'm optimist. Coach, ما فيش شك الإنجاز اللي اتعمل مع منتخب لبنان سواء في الرينكينج نفسه كتصنيف القفزة الكبيرة اللي حصلت النسبة الكبيرة لعدد 16 مرة بدون خسارة التأهل بدون خسارة الأداء الحلو نسبة الأهداف الكويسة الجيل الجديد اللي انت عملته للاعبين بعد جيل ممتاز أنهى مشواره لهم كل التقدير أصبح اسم رادوفيتش في المنطقة العربية أصبح اسمه بينور أمن الأول هو منور بس دلوقتي نور أكتر لو عرض عليك وكان لك حق الاختيار انك تكون كوتش لمنتخب عربي للمرحله ما بعد كاس اسيا انت تتمنى تكون مع اي منتخب وليه I am little surprising now about your question uh, because all my focus now is on my team on my Lebanese team uh, but uh, when I start now to talk to, to think about uh, some national teams there is some uh, teams that I like like Qatar, like Emirates or Saudi Arabia because of facilities about progressing league, about strong league and strong national teams. But if I need to choose one, I will choose a Qatar national team because they are next hosting of World Cup and for all coach it's a dream to be participant on, on, on World Cup because I was participant European Championship, Olympic Game, uh, Asian Champions League, now Asia Cup. Only my dream is to be on World Cup. <laughs> in Qatar I can do, but this is only dreams. Yes, yes. Inshallah, inshallah. Okay. Why, why not? Coach, the question is the last one. We don't want to finish the conversation with you. The conversation with you is fun. The conversation with you is beautiful. توقعاتك الأربع فرق اللي ممكن يوصلوا لسيمي فاينال في كأس آسيا من بين المنتخبات الأربعة وعشرين تتوقع مين؟ This Asian Championship will be very interesting and very strong. There is a lot of teams who can be candidate for big level, big ranking. But for my opinion, I will put South Korea. Iran, Saudi Arabia, and Qatar for favorites for my side. There is teams who can take Asian Cup 2019. This is my opinion. No Japan, no Australia. I think uh, Australia now is a changing generation. It's not easy to change generation because there is no any more Cahill, there is not Yedinak, there is, they now try to change. I think it's very difficult to make competition and uh, change generation and change uh, te young team. But in football all is possible. But this is my, only my opinion. Coach, it's strange that I didn't hear the name of Japan in the four countries that you're trying to get to the semi-final of the Cup. منتخب اليابان منتخب قوي له تاريخ جيد في البطولة حصد اللقب ثلاث مرات عنده كواليتي لاعبين محليين محترفين في كأس العالم الأخيرة قدم وجه كويس غريبة إنك تقول لي اليابان مش هتكون من ضمن الأربعة الأوائل إيه وجهة نظرك؟ I am all my life in professional football and professional football have his rules for my opinion that is not correct, is not logic if some teams changing coach who make success like Japan. Khalil Khodzic, one big coach from uh, former Yugoslavia, my country, he makes success and qualifies them for the World Cup. And without reason, they change them. They paid on World Cup in Asia this price because of changing. And now there are confusion because Coach is a very important role in football. Coach is leader, coach is organizer, psychologist, and coach and, and uh, pedagogue. This is also this price paying also in Spain. They change coach just day before start. 
This is my opinion. Is uh, not correct. In, in, in it is not logic to change coach like Japan, especially coach who make them proud and uh, and uh, reach a World Cup. This is my opinion. أنا بشكرك بشكر اتحاد كرة القدم اللبناني أشكر كل العاملين كل المسؤولين بشكر الجمهور اللبناني اللي وقف مع منتخب بلاده اللي تحول من حب وعشق كرة السلة إلى كرة القدم بناء على هذا النجاح بشكرك على تقديم رسالتك على أكمل وجه وإن الوعد اللي انت وعدته لاتحاد كرة القدم اللبناني وفيت بي من المية خمسة وخمسين على العالم إلى السبعة وسبعين إنجاز عظيم من لك كل توفيق وبشكرك في حلقة خاصة من دمانجر على قنوات الكأس القطرية بشكرك وبتمنى لك التوفيق شكرا كوتش Thank you very much for your coming Thank you very much for your nice word uh, Really I'm enjoy in your program and uh, I'm very satisfied that I have a chance to talk to your channel Thank, Thank you coach. Thank you very much Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.